Hey everyone, I'm in Farming Simulator 22. Here I'm going to show you how to use fertilizer on a field. Um, so you can see this particular field has been cultivated uh, and it's the default one you get in starting the game as a beginner farm and it teaches you all about the basics of using things like the cedar. But the field has not been fertilized at all. Now you can actually fertilize it before you lay the seed and that's one less fertilization that you've got to do because you've got to do that uh, two or maybe more depending on the game um, throughout the um, seeds growth stages to increase the yield of your crops. So let's go and buy a fertilizer and I'll show you how this works and see what we need. So let's go drive to the shop. Um, so the, the sh game doesn't give you a any option to fertilize when you start out. Um, and you'll find in the game that you can do various contracts to fertilize other people's fields if you want, um, or you can you know, not do that. So if we go and drive to the shop, um, we'll talk a little bit about this. So as we're doing this, uh, my tutorials on uh, YouTube, I'm covering all sorts of stuff about Farming Simulator 22. They will grow over time. So if you like uh, this sort of stuff, do please subscribe to the channel and you'll be kept up to date with future tutorials. I'm banging out loads of tutorials on this game. I'm having a lot of fun learning about this game, um, but I'm noticing there's so much stuff to learn um, that I think it's useful to try and share some of this stuff with other people because it's not covered very well in the in-game tutorials. Right, so we are at the shop, so let's buy something. So you just hit your screens button on your Xbox controller and then you will jump into these different areas. And what we need to do is go to the tools. Uh, what we need here is some sort of spreader for our fertilizer. So the easiest one to do are fertilizer spreaders, which we've got here. Uh, and there are different ones that you can get. There are very simple ones that will just do um, you know, very basics about spreading fertilizers, or you can get one that's capable of doing fertilizing and also spreading of lime. So if you have lime on, um, you can, you know, do different ones and, and pick what ones you want. So just be careful here. If you look down, um, sort of where it says the brand name right underneath that, it's got some little icons, some of which show just kind of like a little green leaf and some show a white thing. The white thing is lime. So those ones can spread lime these ones these green ones cannot all right so you may think actually do you know what i'll get one that can do both so I like this one here so we're going to go with this one uh press a to customize and then we're just going to lease it so uh hit x to lease do i want to lease it yes i do okay so you're obviously going to need something to tow this along which is why we've got the uh tractor alongside us um so that's cool we've got that all good and then we need to buy some fertilizer to fill it up with. So if you go to your pallets here, you've got big pa big pallets here. Um, so this is a thousand liters of fertilizer. Um, there's all sorts of different stuff here. You can also buy lime here, and this would work in the same way, but we're gonna talk about fertilizer. So this particular one is using solid fertilizer. So we will hit A, buy that. You see, it's not cheap. You know, 19, 20, it's a lot, of, a lot of money, this stuff. So then when we've got that, that's cool. Come back out. So there's our gear. So first thing we need to do is add the uh, fertilizer machine onto the tractor. Or this fertilizer, <coughs> excuse me, the fertilizer spreader. There we go, so just reverse. And then you also need to be right by the um, stuff that you wanna fill the fertilizer with. So I'm pretty close there, because. As you can see on my tools now, it says I've got an option that says refill fertilizer spreader. So you press down the left stick to do that. So I hit that, it then shows it's fueling. And you can see just down by my speedometer, there's a thing showing how full this is. So that's a thousand liters added. So it's only 11%. So this is a big old spreader. It's capable of adding lots more. So we could, we could buy another one while we're here. Let's buy another pallet just so we've got plenty. So I'll just do that. Uh, yeah, okay. And we'll just add that one as well. There we go. So now we've got all of this stuff and we're good to fertilize our field. So off we go. We're going to drive back to our farm and spread some fertilizer. I'll show you how this works. Now this one is obviously a pretty big machine for the size of field that we've got. Um, but hey ho, we'll, we'll fertilize the field rather fast. <laughs> um, but obviously the bigger the field, um, you know, the more you're gonna benefit from a large fertilizer. So we just drive back. 
Um, and then the tools of the fertilizer, if I hold down LB, just while we're driving, you can see that it's literally the option to turn on fertilizer spreader, that is it. Um, so, you know, it's, it's not rocket science by any means. Uh, and this particular field is a bit of a bit of a funny field. It's a very small one to try and fertilize. So you see this thing whips out the fertilizer on quite a wide spread. Um, so it's just a little bit of practice really to do. So once you're on the field, um, hold down the LB, press X, and you'll see it'll spread. And if we zoom right out, can you see that the sort of field is going a darker color where it's been fertilized? Um, so that's what we're doing here. We're just fertilizing away. And when you get to the end of the field, you're just going to want to turn that off by holding down X. Sorry, I've just hit the map by hitting the LB. But can you see now we've got this different color of where we've spread stuff. So we could go with thinner wheels on the tractor to not have so much horrible marks. It's probably not the best to have these horrible marks on our field, but hey ho, that's what we've got here. We turn the fertilizer on again, and you're looking to cover the entire field with your fertilizer, so everything is all good. Um, so yeah, it's a fairly easy job to apply fertilizer to the field. So as the crop grows, you'll want to do this a few times. So we've got most of the field covered there. I'm just going to go back because I missed a bit right up here. Um, but I'm probably doing a bit of overkill out here. Um, and uh, you're also going to want to think about possibly some storage for your fertilizer, unless you've got lots of fields to fertilize. Then when we're good, we just hit X to turn it off. I'll just come over here with it. So let's just jump out of the tractor and then let's just go and have a little look at our field now. And you can see now fertilized 50% before we've even seeded, which is great. We could then apply the seed. And then as we sleep on the field, this is going to get um, better and better as time goes on. And that's it really. That's how you fertilize a field. Um, just trying to think there was something I was going to tell you about fertilizer as well. You may want to store stuff elsewhere. Uh, oh, yeah. Um, another option is you can fertilize other farmers fields um, so if you want to see what jobs are available if you hit the menu button and then go down to contracts by hitting rb at the minute it's not it's just harvesting and spraying available so, but sometimes you may see fertilizing come up here and you could use your fertilizer to um, help other farmers but you can see there's an option here for spraying fields um, which you could do um, but that's it really um, if that was useful to you, give us a thumbs up, please. Any comments, much appreciated. If I missed anything about fertilizing, do let me know. Um, and I'll try my best to explain it in a future tutorial if I know the answer. Um, if you like this sort of stuff, please subscribe to my channel because I'm doing all sorts of stuff on Farming Simulator 22 and many other Xbox games. You'll see FIFA 22, Forza Horizon 5, many other games on here. Um, and, you know, just do my best to try and help people. So if you can help me by subscribing, that'd be awesome. Thanks so much for your time.